Traylon Burks is primed to break out for the Titans in 2023. After totaling 444 yards and one receiving touchdown on 33 catches in 11 games as a rookie, Burks is ready to make a big jump in his sophomore campaign. Burks' rookie season got off to an extremely slow start as he learned how to control his asthma symptoms, worked through injuries, and missed valuable time during OTAs and training camp. Despite that, Burks was experiencing a mid-season breakout in 2022. He entered week 13 coming off a combined 11 catches for 181 yards in the two prior games, then started the week 13 game with a 25-yard touchdown on the team's second drive, holding on between two defenders but unfortunately suffering a concussion on the play just as he was finally reaching his potential. That was his last snap of the season with Ryan Tannehill at quarterback. In his games with Tannehill, Burks never reached 70% of team snaps in a game as he worked to earn the trust of his coaching staff. But when Burks returned in week 16, with Tannehill done for the year, he played 82%, 72%, and 74% of snaps in the final three games of the season, having finally earned that trust. He now enters year two, ready to take on a much larger role. Look, it's hype season all around the league, and we often get carried away with training camp reports, but the drumbeat for Traylon Burks coming out of Nashville has been loud and steady since OTAs. And sometimes, we can learn which players are actually ready to take a big step forward. Just listen to what his teammates and coaches have said about him. You know, Traylon obviously is a guy that stood out. You can tell he's been working. Watching him out here, I can tell that he's taking his game to another level. Traylon looks like a different beast this year, for sure. Honestly, he's, he's, been, he's been a different, different player. Last year, in the eight games Burks played with Tannehill at quarterback, he averaged 2.43 yards per route run, which would have ranked 11th in the league. And yards per route run has typically been a strong predictor of NFL success. Burks was also 15th in contested catch rate at 58.3%, 12th in yards after catch per reception at 5.4, and ranked 7th among all receivers in big play percentage at 17.2%, as he produced 8 20 plus yard catches and 2 10 plus yard runs on just 58 looks, setting him up well to be a big play machine for the Titans if given more opportunities down the field. Last year, Burks ran just 254 routes, ranking 102nd among all receivers. In Tim Kelly's offense, the Titans are expected to play faster and pass the ball more, especially on early downs. Kevin Byard recently let slip, probably on accident, that Kelly wants to be a more pass-heavy offense. At the end of the day, I know, you know, Tim Kelly wants to throw the ball over the field. And tight end Chig Conquo hinted that those passes will be quicker to help out the O-line. A lot of speed, is a lot of plays with uh, where we're trying to go really fast and just um, take what we can before the defense can get there trying to outflank guys. All of this will give Burks more opportunities to be productive. If he can stay healthy, he could easily more than double his number of routes run. In Tim Kelly's 2019 Houston Texans offense, DeAndre Hopkins ran 682 routes. That's 2.6 times the amount Burks ran last year. He's put in the work this offseason. He has his asthma under control. He's worked hard to keep his body in great shape, even changing his diet. And he spent time building chemistry with Ryan Tannehill as they trained together in Florida over the summer. Burks is playing with more confidence than ever, not having to think as much, and he's actually having fun on the field. You just see him getting more confident in himself. I think he's just playing with a lot of confidence. I think he's playing with a lot of confidence right now. I think he's much more confident. I just feel like I'm just going out there and just having fun, playing with my teammates, not thinking too much. Being able to go out there and play fast and, and again, eliminate the thinking and let him go and do what he does best. I would say I feel faster because I can breathe. Yeah. <laughs> With the addition of DeAndre Hopkins to the Titans receiving core, Burks will see better matchups, less double teams, and won't have the pressure on his shoulders of being the Titans' only threat at receiver. After an extremely productive college career and an up-and-down rookie season, the former first-round pick has all the makings of a star, primed and ready to break out in 2023. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like it, subscribe to the channel, and drop a comment below.